Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the thermal wax choke actuator on your engine, first make sure the engine has cooled. Next, you should remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. Press the retaining tabs down to release the air housing cover and set the cover and air filter aside. Use a 10 mm socket to unthread the mounting bolts, securing the air filter housing and carburetor. Remove the loose components. Use small channel lock pliers to help pull the old choke actuator out of the engine. This may require some effort. Install the new Thermowax choke actuator by inserting it into the engine and pressing it firmly into place. Insert the mounting bolts through the housing. Slide on the air cleaner gasket, followed by the carburetor. Now slide on the air guide gasket, followed by the choke control assembly. Slide on the intake gasket, then thread the bolts into the engine and tighten to secure. Replace the air filter in the housing, then align the lower cover tabs with the housing and snap the upper tabs into place. With the repair completed, reattach the wire and boot to the spark plug and your engine should be ready for use.